So, this is Minecraft, but stone cutters are OP. For example, I can convert an iron ingot into an iron block. This video is crazy, so make sure to watch to the end to see what I can get. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy the video. Okay, so in this world, stone cutters are really OP. And it's a perfect start because we're in this village and we can grab ourselves iron, which can lead to our stone cutter really, really fast. And boom, I got my necessary stone axe and my stone pickaxe. And now we can go grab ourselves this golem. Okay, we got four pieces of iron. That is pretty good. So now we can use that iron to make our stone cutter. But first, we need our stone. Okay, so now all we have to do is we have to put three stone on the bottom just like that and one piece of iron It is a normal stone cutter. It seems like it anyways, but it is trust me It is not so let's place it down put this here and let's for example put our one piece of iron in there Oh my gosh look at all this so if we get ourselves a block of iron we can grab that block of iron convert that and then put more of that, and then we can just keep doing this. It is an infinite amount of iron, and then boom, we got over a stack of iron. Okay, and bucket. There we go. So now we have quite a good, lot of good things. I got myself the bread, full iron armor, a shield, st iron axe, and iron pickaxe. So that's really good. Okay, well, there's a ravine right here. Is there diamonds? Well, I'm not too sure. I see lapis. But I'm not sure if I see diamonds. So this this ravine is literally right next to the village. This is good. Oh gosh. Okay. Well, this is a lot, lot bigger than I thought. Oh my gosh. Okay. It's pretty deep down, so I think we should be able to find some diamonds somewhere. Oh, right here. No problem at all. Okay, we can just grab ourselves these sweet, sweet diamonds. How much we got? Four so far. Okay, we got eight. How much is this? Okay, eight. This is this is pretty good. It's pretty good. Okay, eight diamonds. Honestly, we only needed one, but you know what? Eight is nice too, because now we can put it inside of the stone cutter. Dude, that's actually insane. So if we just grab eight blocks of diamond. Stat oh my gosh, over a stack of diamonds. So now we can make ourselves a full set of diamond armor. I, I barely even got to use my, my set of iron stuff. So now we can make ourselves some easy diamond armor okay well i mean we're got full diamond now and i guess we're we're good with that so now we can now make ourselves our nether portal right there grab the gold there we go one raw gold and then if we smelt it okay so for gold yep there we go we got a gold ingot and then if we place it on our stone cutter and golding it oh wait we can get enchanted golden apples okay that's actually super good so we can make block of gold Boom, convert that into more gold, put this, and then just more blocks of gold. Boom, and so you see how this can get super OP? Yeah, it, it, it's actually insane. So if we do this, chant a gold, <laughs> uh, okay. Well, that is um super, super OP. Grab ourselves some more gold, and put it back in, and get ourselves more in, oh my gosh, 33 enchanted golden apples. Oh my gosh! I'm actually so crazy! Holy! Okay, I'm gonna make this portal properly this time. And just a few more, like that. And then we just gotta put the bottom ones. And then we should be on our way into the nether. So, okay, that should be a full portal. Now I just gotta find myself some gravel, which is right here. So, that's good. Okay, we got ourselves our flint and steel. Now we can light the portal. Let's go and hopefully we get a good spawn. Oh, okay, right beside a lava lake. Do you know what? It's not the worst, I guess, but uh, I was hoping for a fortress right off the spawn. Oh, let's go. Fortress right there. Okay, we're in. That's pretty good. Now it's, oh, blaze spawner right there. That's actually so perfect. These blazes are not gonna be a problem since I have my enchanted golden apple, which gives me fire resistance. So that's gonna be super, super helpful with these blazes. All right, I'm just trading with these piglin dudes and hopefully they'll give me some per Oh, pearls right there. Well, yeah. Well, hopefully they'll give me a ton of pearls and then I can get out of here quick. Okay, so I got myself all of the pearls that I need, even there's some leftovers here, but I got 16 pearls which is more than enough, and now we can go back to the overworld. Alright, well, we are back into the overworld, so now we can make ourselves our, uh, our, our eyes of ender. And then we can throw these, and then we can see where the stronghold is.
Oh, let's go. Okay, the stronghold's right here. So we can start digging down, and then hopefully we can grab ourselves the portal and we have enough eyes. Alrighty, we're in. Now we just gotta find ourselves the stupid portal. Oh, what the? Wait, the portal was right where I dug. That's actually crazy. Okay, let's kill these silverfish. Oh my gosh. I actually almost forgot, but I got myself a bow. So good thing I remembered that. Now we can go inside. So let's put the eyes. There we go. Okay, what kind of spawn we got? Oh gosh. Okay, that scares me. That always scares me. All right, we're out of the little wall. So now it's boss fight time. Let's grab ourselves our bow. We may, we gotta make sure we got our beds, you know, because we gotta explode this dragon. We got ourselves a bow and a bunch of arrows from the piglins. So this will make breaking the crystals a lot easier. Okay, well, I got a few crystals down with my bow. Oh, jeez. Okay, that did a lot of damage. We're gonna eat a gap right away. Okay, well, yeah. Anyways, I got a lot of crystals with my arrows that I got from the piglins. So now we can just go up to these cage ones. And we can hit them with our, you know, with our water bucket strategy. Because we can just climb up the tower easily. Boom. There we go. Now, where are the other ones? Okay, the other ones are over there. So we gotta get over there real quick. Okay, so I wanna climb up one of these big towers, not only just to destroy the crystal, but to get a really high point of the end. And I can try and snipe all the crystals from here. Let's just try and get up real quick before the dragon hits me off. Come on, come on, this water is not fast enough. Okay, I'm on the top, so now let's just break this one. Let's just grab ourselves some blocks. Boom, okay. Now we can, yep, there we go. So this is gonna make breaking all these top crystals super, super easy. Boom, I think there's one over there. Yeah, it's just like out of my distance. Uh, that's actually super annoying. So let's try and bridge over there really, really carefully. Okay, let's go, come on. Make sure Dragon doesn't hit us off. Okay, grab wood. Oh gosh, okay, go up, go up. Oh, jeez, okay. Yeah, see, there is a crystal there. It was just out of my render distance. Okay, there we go, we got it. Is that all of them? Let's just down. Oh no, there's some over there I saw. Oh, that's really far away. Guess we gotta get down then. Okay, I think I got all the crystals because the dragon is not healing anymore. So we can go back down and then we can start bedding this dragon. So let's try and get down safely without hitting any of that smoke. Yeah, actually, it'll be fine. Okay, let's grab ourselves our bed. Yep, okay. Let's go, let's go into the middle before purchase. Oh, oh, it's already perching. Oh, no, I did not see that. Okay, we should be fine. Okay, there we go. We're fine. Let's go back. Ah, I didn't realize I was perching until I, until I already got hit. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I'm going to go back into the middle. I'm going to be prepared for the next time it perches. Oh, okay. It's going to perch. Let's get ready. Place the beds. Okay, come on. Boom. Okay. Oh, okay, we should be fine. Yep, we're fine. We got the fire resistance, boy. Okay, where's the head? All right, it's over here. Boom, and boom, boom. Okay, that did a ton of damage. Oh, I didn't, I, I wasn't prepared. I didn't have more beds out. Okay, there we go. Okay, that did a ton of damage. All right, the dragon is perching. This should be the final time it perches. So let's get ready to blow this dragon up. Okay, where's the head? Okay, the head is over here. Okay, so we can do that. This boom! Goodbye, dragon. You will be missed when we are finished. Okay, this enderman, please stop. You're not part of the boss battle. We did it! Let's go! 